Celebrating 150 years, BASF has employees around the globe that teach hands-on, inquiry-based science to our youth. BASF creates chemistry for a sustainable future. Welcome to Science Club with BASF. I'm Lily. I'm here with Product Manager Jared O'Connell from BASF. Today, we want to see just how many drops of water this little penny can hold. Hydrogen bonds and surface tension gives water some incredible properties. So how many drops of water can we fit on a penny? Let's find out. Let's start with a clean, dry penny. Place the penny on a flat surface. Using an eyedropper or pipette, carefully drop individual drops onto the flat surface of the penny. Keep track of the drops as you add them until the water runs over the sides. We got 44. Try the experiment again with salt water. Does it make a difference on the cohesion and hydrogen bonding? It did for us. What if you used vegetable oil? What impact did the material have on cohesion and hydrogen bonding? Go to abc11.com slash science club for instructions and visit us on Facebook to see behind the scenes footage. Thanks for watching Science Club with BASF. Celebrating 150 years, BASF has employees around the globe that teach hands-on, inquiry-based science to our youth. BASF creates chemistry for a sustainable future.